Good morning! Welcome back to my channel. My name is Marie Tu. Today is Saturday. Yesterday I had my white coat ceremony, finally. It felt like a surreal moment, honestly. <laughs> I just still can't believe that I've reached my goal, that I actually did that. Um, sometimes, you know, you have dreams and you hope and you pray that you get to them. But sometimes it just doesn't happen and whatnot, but it really did happen for me and I'm so happy. So I'm going to drop a little clip of what I could film. I know I couldn't film a lot, but I wanted to live in the moment and also like vlogging during a white coat ceremony. I don't know about that, but <laughs> let me show you what I got in video receiving my white coat was a dream come true a moment i've worked so hard for and waited so long to experience it's more than just a coat of course it's a symbol of dedication passion and commitment to serving others i'll forever cherish this milestone as a reminder of the journey ahead let's go <laughs> So now I'm going breakfast, well for brunch actually, with my two girlies. Um, we're going to the new mall called Royal Mount in Montreal. It's very schmancy spancy and very expensive too. But <laughs> we're going to Eva's and that restaurant already exists but it's a new one, a new location there. So we're gonna try it out and yeah. right before we leave, let me show you the fit. Um, this is a cute little fit, of course, because it's still very hot in Canada, which is super fun. Well, I'll say Quebec. Well, I'll say the greater Montreal, okay? <laughs> because I don't want people in the comments telling me that in Alberta it's cold. But it's really, really fun. It's really fun. So, I'm still wearing summer clothes because until... The day we cannot anymore. I'm gonna wear summer clothes. I'm wearing a skirt. This is like my favorite thing in the whole wide world that I bought. It's from Zorot. Um, and <laughs> it's a crisscross asymmetrical, asymmetrical skirt. And I look naked from the back, but that's fine. That's fine. This top is from Dynamite. It's a ribbed top tank top it's kind of like the dupe of the aritzia ones they don't make them anymore like this so i'm literally trying to keep them keep it the most like keep it the most pristine ever because they've changed like the fabric like the material is not the same i don't like it so um and this top is from moon river well the, the little button up is from moon river i love it so much it's corduroy and it's ribbed, but I bought it at Winners and it was like 50 bucks, but I get it. I get it. I get it. I wear it all the time and I've literally, it was the bang for my buck because this shirt was originally like 150, which, huh? But anyways, yeah, so that's my little outfit. I'm wearing a crossbody bag from Matt and Nat. But yeah, little outfit of the day and I might be wearing just like normal sandals just like oh my god fun fact actually very very sad fact <laughs> i did a foot mask with my bestie maybe a week ago yeah a week ago and i didn't think i didn't really calculate the fact that i would be peeling the day like the days leading up to my white coat ceremony so the day of my white coat ceremony <laughs> i had literally skin falling off of my feet I had skin falling off of my feet who's dumb? me who wants to go to Four Seasons Orlando? me literally me my feet were so like not cute I don't know why I did that but I didn't think I wasn't thinking <sighs> anyways it's, it was fun. It was fun. I really, really enjoyed my white coat ceremony, as you probably saw in the previous clips. Um, and yeah, it's going to be a good four years. I can sense it. I can sense it. 
from the brunch i have a concert at eight tonight but i'm gonna work a little bit on my school stuff because i have a lot that a lot of things to do um so i'm thinking i'm gonna do all the like admin -y, i call it admin things <laughs> like um research on projects and everything that for me is the admin and then like memorizing will be for tomorrow um so Sorry about the noise everywhere. Everybody's, <laughs> you know. Anyways, so today I'm going to do my pre lab for next week because my labs are every Tuesdays. God damn. My labs are every Tuesday, and then I'm gonna do a um, prepare for my oral presentation that I have for the same class. And then I have another, I have to answer two questions out of the 10 questions for my law class. And then what, what else do I have to do today? Like right now, that's it. Those are the three things that I'm going to do right now. The recap for one of my classes that I had yesterday, I'm going to do maybe tonight after the concert. I'm not sure. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. But then tomorrow, I'll, I think I'm going to wake up kind of early. Not that early, but kind of early. I might go to the library. I might not. I'm not sure. But this is how my to-do list is looking. Not too crazy. Honestly, not too crazy. I can stay afloat. <laughs> I'm getting along with the top 50 and the top 6 um, prescription, the not prescription drugs that I have to memorize. I am using the blur method, so I'm blurring everything that I know and then I'm rereading everything um, and like rewriting everything that I'm missing and every important thing that I'm missing, especially for like, for example, like ibuprofen. You gotta eat, you gotta take it with food because it might irritate your stomach, your TGI <laughs> so these are like important things that you should know you know what I'm talking about like alendronat you gotta take it 30 minutes before eating and like with clear water just water because food like other drinks might alter it and like um, the statins the statin they um, could cause myalgi myalgi or like um, rhabdo you can't eat grapefruit with those because it alters it you know what I mean like different things like that I you guys I love I love what I'm doing I really love what I'm doing I think I'm really on my ex you know everybody needs to be on their, their little ex somewhere in their life like find their purpose I don't know if that's like <laughs> my purpose I feel like it's a big thing to say but I'm really happy yeah I'm really happy and I hope it stays that way Let's hope it stays away. Let's breathe. It stays that way. <laughs> but let's stop yapping and let's start working. Okay, I had the time to do one assignment, so. That's fun. Um, now it's time to get dressed to go see Daju and Taiki. Once again, I went to see Daju. I went to see Taiki. Now they're together. They're French singing, French speaking singers. And I love them. But I've been traumatized. So let's hope it's a good night tonight. I don't know what to wear. I might just wear the same thing as today. I have to figure it out right now because I need to go to my friends first and then we go. 
to the concert. Anyways, I'll figure it out. <laughs> Final look. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? It's literally the quickest thing I found. I didn't know what to wear and I don't want to be like uncomfortable. I am not the one to wear heels to a concert. It's not gonna be me. So I'm gonna wear my little platform sandals, you know, very comfy, very cute. And I put my hair in a bun because yeah, I like this towel. Like I like doing this. It's like a little, you know, it's giving, it's giving cute. It's giving, I didn't try too much, you know, but I did. <laughs> okay, so let's go. <laughs> Where are we going? To the Bell Center. Je vais chanter toutes les larmes de mon corps parce que je n'ai plus de voix. C'est mon objectif de ce soir. Yeah. Can't wait. <laughs> Et si je te dis que j'ai...